The next step is coping the radius end. To do that, you'll need a coping saw and a pattern. Use the pattern to trace the two radii on one end of the board. Be sure the ends of the two boards line up perfectly. Remember, our board that we're making needs to stay six and three quarters inches long. So we're going to line up this end right here. Okay, there's a three quarter inch radius and a one inch radius. For extra credit, for a higher grade, use the drawings below on the other page to construct your own radii. They are one inch and three quarter inches. Leave your construction marks on the board to receive credit for this. If you want to do this and learn how, I'll make another video for that. Okay, so I'm going to trace the radii right here. There's one, and there's two. And if I really want to make this accurate, I'm going to turn this over and mark the radii on the other side. Okay, see how I did this? I, didn't, I turned the boards over together so that they match. Turn the boards over together so that the big radius matches up there. Okay, clamp the board on a vise and use a coping saw to cut the two radii. Be sure your cut is at 90 degrees to the face of the board. Cut with smooth, even strokes. Use a file to clean up the cuts when you are done. So we're gonna put this in here vertically this time. And to make the cut, the best way is to use your thumbnail right on the edge, line up right there, and when it says hold it square to the face, make sure your saw doesn't turn this way or this way. Make sure it stays 90 degrees to the face of the board. And you're going to cut this. Use your thumb to get it started. I notice right now that the saw is flat this way. As I continue the cut, notice the saw raises up. Try to stay on the outside of the pencil line. That's kind of ugly. Let's try the other side. Okay, notice on the back side, it did tear out the wood. So we're gonna use a, a file to clean that up later. Let's see if we can make this one work better. Okay, now we'll use a file to clean that up. Of course, I'm going to be sure to throw away my scraps. Okay, we'll need a file out of the toolkit. And we just want to go very lightly over this. Again, everything we do is with smooth, even strokes. You don't want to push really hard on this. Just smooth, even strokes. Notice as I'm doing this, it's causing some tear out back here. We want to be careful not to push too much this direction, but keep the file flat on the board. Okay, I just caused a tear out right there. Look at that. Oh, I cut off part of my name. Okay, we want to turn the board over and do the same thing on this side. And we have coped the end radius.